Alrighty everybody, welcome back once again to another mashup here with Adam, your dog trainer. I am he, he is I, and I am here just for you. If this is your first time watching, please consider smashing that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to hit the little bell for notifications. Also, please go ahead, hit that thumbs up because that really helps us out in the long run in the big pictures, so this way people know that we like this video. Also, please feel free to follow me on my Instagram page at Adam Your Dog Trainer, where I post pictures of my students on a daily basis. Lastly, I did just start a new Facebook group uh, called Adam Your Dog Trainer's YouTube Community. Please go ahead, check that one out. You will find that on Facebook. I will post the link below. Alrighty guys, so let's get to today's mashup. Today we have two pretty uh, quiet, I like to call them quiet killers. Um, one of them being one of the top of the line, Cadillac, Mercedes, the luxury of all dog foods. That is Akena, and it is their uh, fish formula. And you know, it is Heritage is a fantastic formula, so we're gonna put that one right up there. And then we have our Nature's Recipe, which is a growing brand. It's been out for years. It's kind of like the small little engine that could, and you can slowly see this throughout like grocery stores and Targets, um, some of the Petco's and Pet Supermarkets and PetSmarts carry uh, some of their line. Um, it's starting to low, slowly become one of the premium grocery brand foods that you'll find in the States here. Alrighty guys, so let's go ahead, get to today's mashup, and let's see what we got. I'll see you guys after the three hours. Deuces! Alrighty, everybody, here we go one more time back at it again. We have our mashup set. This one is Nature's Recipe Grain Free Real Salmon and Pumpkin and Sweet Potato Formula. This one is Akena uh, Heritage Formula Grain Free, also with our two cups of white vinegar. Three hours. See you guys later. Deuces. Alrighty, so after the three hours, what did you think? Leave me a comment below and let me know what you think about these two foods going head to head. But I'm gonna tell you what I think and you tell me if I'm correct. All right, that's kinda that's how this is gonna work. We're gonna leave some comments, I'm gonna respond to you, and we're gonna have some fun, all right? We're kinda changing things up a little bit. So let's first talk about nature's recipe. That'd be this one. Uh, Nature's Recipe did a pretty good job breaking down. You can easily see the finger, nice ambery color. You know, the food did not leave a lot of residue on the top here, but there is some, I'm sorry the lights are super bright today. There is some, um, there are a lot of bubbles. If you can make out the bubbles there, there we go. A lot of bubbles in there. And so, you know, very good, but eh not perfect the bubbles we still don't really know what's going on with the bubbles but we do assume that it's gases that are trapped inside when cooked in high temperatures alrighty so let's look at the Akena Akenia I can't keep saying that wrong this food was actually very impressive um, it broke down we had some at the bottom we have some at the top you can literally see the finger on the back here. It's actually almost clear, which is perfect. That's what we want to see. No ring around the top. No, absolutely no bubbles on the on the top there. 
and I will even show you the top view so you can get a look at that. So, you know, my thoughts of this, you know, it's kind of a toughie because, you know, the bubbles make out a big thing. I did notice that uh, Akena did expand a lot, but it did break down. So, is that good or bad? I'm going to say that's actually pretty decent. Um, you know, at the end of the day, we're looking at a good high value food here. Um, this would be considered the, the luxury of dog foods, the superfood, you know, compared to what we would consider a high end grocery brand, you know. Um, very close though, very close. I actually want to give a lot of respect to, you know, the Nature's Recipe. It's always been a good, well balanced formula. Secretly, it was actually one of the foods I used to feed to my cats. Um, so until my store stopped carrying the, the cat formula, you know, which I'm really kind of mad about, but we will not save that for another day. Um, you know, but I think, I think for the price, Nature's Recipe is really a great formula. Fantastic, you can't beat it. It's a great price. If budget is not an issue, then I would definitely go to the other, which would be for the winner, Akena is definitely a higher end formula broke down much better um clear water um almost drinkable but not really drinkable you guys who've seen me do this before in the past you know how i operate here and so yeah you know this one's gonna go to the higher end food but it doesn't mean that that nature's recipe is a horrible brand it is a fantastic formula for the price that you're getting i would say it's probably one of the best grocery brand dog foods on the market today uh, it beats out probably blue. It beats out all the Purinas, the Pro Plans, the Puppy Chows, the Benefuls, and those are all in the same price point. So yeah, that's really, really good. Fantastic formula you can find at your local grocery store. Alrighty guys, what are your comments about this? Because this is actually a really unique situation where we have a high-end grocery brand versus a high-end luxury brand. Tell me what your thoughts are in the comments below. I'll see you guys next time for another mashup. I got a bunch of things going on this week. I'm sorry I didn't get to post anything last week. I was just bogged down at work. Um, but I will get back in the saddle here and I will see you guys going forward. Everyone have a great day. And uh, we will continue our series on heat with your dogs um, and you know, walking on concrete, keep your dogs in the car, keep them cool when it's hot outside. So yeah, that's actually coming uh, so we have a whole bunch of series going on. So yeah, keep an eye for that. And I'll see you guys next time here on Adam.